So, uh, the Capstone Project. What do I know about the Capstone Project? Uh, I know you get assigned it in grade nine, career education. Uh, so I got mine in grade ten because the Ministry of Education changed curriculum on us and grade nine summer vacation. Big thank you to those guys. But uh, yeah, you get it in grade nine, education, career education, and it's due in grade 12, and it's a requirement for graduation. Um, and that's literally all that I know about it up to this point. And depending on whether or not you're watching this in grade 12 right now and have also been assigned a project but have been putting it off for the past two years because you either just didn't care or totally forgot about it, uh, you probably don't know anything about it besides that either and now are trying to figure out what on earth it is that you have to do. Uh, so I, that makes two of us. Uh, and my situation is that I've been assigned this project and know nothing about it. Thankfully, I have found someone who does. So according to the uh, British Columbia Ministry of Education, uh, so this is their description of it, not mine, uh, a capstone project also known as a culminating project or experience or senior exhibition, among other terms, is a project that allows students to demonstrate their learning using an area or areas of interest as the basis for their project. Ideally, this would be in an area that they are passionate about and anticipate they will be pursuing after graduation. In Career Life Connections, that's the class you have to do it for, Students will design, assemble, and present a capstone project to an audience to demonstrate personal learning and achievement in and out of school, growth in the core competencies, and a reflection on the post-graduation plan. So uh, that's the basic gist of what it is that I have to do. It also includes a list. Can you see that? A list of things that you have to include uh, in in the project, uh, I'll I'll like I'll list them on the screen as well so you can read them. Uh, the first one is proposal. Uh, the proposal outlines the project and includes disciplinary and core competency connections, timelines, and product. There's the mentor, and the mentor is ideally a shared role that includes teachers and or community members that provide guidance throughout the culminating project. Uh, number three is research. The research is an essential component that informs each student's culminating project. Product, which is the end result of the project. Uh, this can be a document, performance, uh, something constructed, video. Uh, presentation is number five on the list. Uh, the presentation can have a variety of forms and happens with an audience composed of teachers, community members, and or others connected to the student and or their culminating project. So basically, uh, what we learned from that is it can be about whatever you want presented to an audience of who knows, maybe your grandparents, maybe the principal, maybe the head of the Ministry of Education. It doesn't, it does not say. Uh, and it can be in whatever format you want, about whatever you want. And that is the most vague description of anything that I could ever 
describe in in ever in ever in ever just ever uh, there is there is one more part here that I wanted I was I just wanted to point it out when the 10 12 career education or curricula ooh there's a there's a smart word curricula curricula are revised based on feedback and finalized it is intended that instructional samples created by teachers will be added to highlight the personalized opportunities present within these courses and the choice and flexibility for course delivery within local contexts. Final capstone guidelines will also be developed through the review and feedback process. Uh, the last sentence, particularly, the final capstone guidelines will be developed, will be also, will be, will be developed. So they, these are not even the final instructions. These are just, this is the proposal for the project before the curriculum was even changed. And I did try to look for the final guidelines too. Couldn't find them. Either didn't look hard enough or someone at the Ministry of Education is sitting on their butt. But either way, didn't, I don't have them. I just have this to work with. But it, it okay, in all fairness, I have an idea of what I'm going to do. And I do, I do have an, I, I do have a plan. Sort of. It's, it is an idea. It's not, it's not a plan. It's an idea. It's a concept. It's a, con it's a conceptual idea. Yes. <laughs>